This is Guadalajara, Mexico, as 1.5 million people see it every day, behind the car wheel. Over 4 million people live in or around this city, making it the second largest in the country and one of the 100 most populated urban areas in the world. It's getting larger by the day. Here's the problem. All those people need to get around somehow. As I said, there are 1.5 million cars on the road, and every day, 300 more are added. Gridlocks everywhere, pollution in the air. 75% of the city's air pollutants come from its traffic most coming from old and unregistered vehicles that fail to comply with emission standards. To make things worse, many other cities around the world are facing the same problems. A UN report estimated that the world's urban populations in Africa, Asia and Latin America will nearly double by 2030. So what does the future look like? Can we expect everyone to replace their old cars with hybrids? Let's get serious. Let's invest in mass transit and build a network of electric passenger trains to move crowds throughout the city. Like Washington's own metro, which serves almost a million people every day. If a metro is fast, affordable and connects the city together, people will ride it. Building them is expensive, but the largest cities in the world, like New York, Mexico City and Tokyo, all rely on them. A metro would reduce the demand for cars and help cities cope with explosive growth. Let's encourage their construction in developing countries and clean up this mess.